everyone so first of four video reviews this week is for um the last month's uh book club read which was um so lay reviews book club for march we read the brutal truth by lee winter and i'm probably gonna mess this up because i'm so excited to to do this review um because i i loved this book i did um if you want to check out my goodreads review there is a link below um in the description if you're on youtube and if you're on facebook there is a link below all the other videos um, and like i say this is a video review for the brutal truth by lee winter so for any of you that didn't see the original introduction video which is hanging around on youtube you can find it it's also somewhere on facebook if you want to scroll back all through the posts to the beginning of march um this is what the book looks like it's one hell of a book i mean look at it whack you know it's really heavy you could do a workout with this book it's great um but i love the paperback and i'm very much attached to it i bought it over a year ago it's literally been sitting on the shelf i kept meaning to get around to it i had so many review copies and review books to read and so when they said they were going to do this book for march book club i was beyond excited i couldn't wait to pick it up i have heard nothing but fantastic things about this book so as you can imagine i had higher expectations before i even started any of you that were then reading along with reading updates will just know how much I was just oh I loved every second of it um, but I have one word for this book I do um Lee is a very talented writer I've said it before I've reviewed a couple of her books she has an absolute talent and I am giving her the crown the crown of writing ice queens she's just fantastic at it and therefore this book this book is a classic this this is the type of book that I can see in years to come people will be like oh yeah the brutal truth by lee winter did you read it yeah yeah it's amazing it's amazing it's amazing it's like it's a classic book it's just so stylish so fashionable it has humor it 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 has romance it has drama it has passion ice queen age gap all these things that i love um literally addicted to this book i i really because i had to make it last it was awful having to make it last a month because i really didn't want to put it down but i did enjoy putting it down because it meant i got to save every moment of it just that little bit more so the thing is here right so mag um Maddie really wouldn't approve because I don't have my, my grungy t-shirt on. I don't have any grunge band t-shirts. I was trying to find one to wear for the video review, but I, re I really don't have any. That's really uncool. Like, the closest thing I had was a Dolly Parton t-shirt. And I love Dolly Parton, don't get me wrong, but it's not a grunge band. I'm going to wear it for Maddie. So, we're stuck with me with my fashionable work wear on um, whilst I review The Brutal Truth. So, anyway, back to the book very first page i was completely like completely and utterly hooked on this story elena bartle is like oh the ultimate i love her so much i fell in love with her from the very first moment that maddie had her little altercation with her and i just knew i just knew the chemistry between the two of them was just gonna like literally explode from the pages and it did it properly like just leapt out of the pages um i literally just the main characters maddie and elena they they couldn't have been more different yet more the same and yet their chemistry was literally it was on fire it just it was immense it was so good like you can tell i'm really really excited about it i just was like because oh, i can't even think of the right words for it. it just it just oh it gave me all these like oh i just loved it every second of it like literally like and because elena's an ice queen she's just so tough to crack she definitely was tougher than the other ice queens to crack she like the ultimate ice queen she just was not cracking like it didn't matter what maddie did she just was not really giving in she was giving hints but she just she was she was airing on the side of caution like to the left you know she was like way out there she wasn't even on the line of like mm, you know i'll dabble she was like properly like like oh she just all infuriating sometimes because you just really wanted her to crack and she wasn't going to um but it was amazing it was literally so amazing the power and authority that elena had a just she's a dream you will love every like if ice queens are your thing elena bartle is your thing you will love her like literally this book is amazing i can't say much more about it without giving away the whole story but it was just totally amazing and i tell you what the best thing bringing this story to life was the imagery so you know this exciting and intense plot brilliant characters and it just felt so real i could close my eyes and i was literally in the room with elena and maddie i was there i was right there i was feeling it i was experiencing it and i was just oh right there i could see it perfectly like in my mind's eye when i was reading and like then don't even get me started when natalie and veronique came into it 
and they started talking oh, i could hear it all immensely in french and like that's ridiculous how can you read and, and hear french like that's literally what i was hearing that i was experiencing it as if as if somebody was reading the book to me it was like it it was like it out of experience it was so it was so weird but it was it's because lee just has the talent she has the talent to write like that that you get so swept up in the book and the story the characters and everything you're reading that you become lost in it and it's just amazing to be lost in it so this is one of those times where i wish i had the book witch you know from from annette's book witch book because they want her to put me right in this book i would love to be like if i could be any more physically in this book it would be amazing um but it was just, oh, the way she'd done the dialogue with the French for Natalie and um, Veronique was just amazing. I really loved it. And then there's the way Elena says, Madeleine. Like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Like, and people have told me that I need to get the audiobook of this so that I can actually hear that. And I, I have to. I'm going to have to because I'm just completely obsessed with this book. It is. I put a question out there the other day about favourite books because I have so many favourite books but like how do you have like a favourite favourite like favourite like this is like the ultimate favourite is it I don't I don't know I have so many favourite books but this one I just know that I love it with such an intensity that I'm so glad I have a paperback copy of it I'm definitely going to read it again at some point because I just cannot it's literally calling to me it's on my lap and it's like open me read me it's amazing um so if you haven't read this book I highly recommend that you do read this book because you are missing out on something fantastic like literally your life will never be the same once you have read the brutal truth it really really won't um and so you know if you have the book or you have it in your wish list on Amazon or like me you had it on a shelf it's been staring you in the face for like over a year bad that's very bad you need to go and read it go and read it now treat yourself go on go and pick it up right this second get started you seriously will not regret it it is fantastic um so with all that because you can see how much I love this book oh, I'm still I'm like still thinking about it like right now like oh my god have I missed saying anything because it was just so fantastic um literally cannot sing its praises enough um if you want to go and grab a copy of the brutal truth i will pop a link in the description so that you can because you should um if you've read the brutal truth by lee winter i know i discussed it with a whole load of you at the end of march in book club um and that was a great discussion but if you didn't take part in book club or you missed the discussion if you've read the brutal truth please let me know what you thought of it because i'd really love to know um and if you haven't read it yet or if it's on your to read list or you are planning to read it soon again i would really really love to know because um like i say it's just a fantastic book and the more people that read this book the more lives that get changed um and so with that if you do read this book i hope you love it as much as i do and in the famous words of the ever amazing um elena bartle we're done.